We all love new designs and especially when it comes in the matter of iPhone, we really love the designs of iPhone. That's the reason because Apple always put so much money in research and development for the iPhone designs and when the iPhone 10 comes to the market, we really love the notch designs. The funny fact is from the iPhone, many are just trying to copy out the designs and now we are going to talk about it. Especially the companies like Vivo and the OnePlus 6 I think, they're just copying the notch design and coming back to in the market to get more customers I think. So uh, today we are going to discuss about one of the most trending phone in the market right now, Vivo V9. So let's get started. Hi guys, I'm Shahin. In this video, I'm going to give you a detailed explanation and uh, other parameters about Vivo V9, all its specification and designs. So guys, you're not supposed to forget to subscribe our channel and you have to click on the bell icon for another notification. We'll come back soon with some exciting videos. The first thing what I loved in the Vivo V9 is the all new design. The company promises 19 is to 9 full view display and 19% screen ratio along with 400 pixel density. Moving on, the phone has 1.75 mm bezels and 6.3 inches display. Specifically, all the designs this mobile phone had is copied from iPhone 10. So I'll show you the reasons why I stated that. The first one is, you can see here, the notch. The same thing is there for iPhone 10. So another one we have is notification bar. The same way they have just inspired from the iPhone, I think. They just copied iPhone, I think. Now speaking about the specifications and processor, Vivo V9 uses 2.2 GHz Snapdragon 626 octa-core processor and as you can see here 8.10 is the Android version. Compare it with the Note 5 Pro, they use 7.1.1 Android version. So I suggest you if you are going for the performance, you can go for Vivo V9 and they, they are available for 4GB RAM along with 64GB ROM. Vivo V9 have 3216mAh battery and they have one feature called Super Power Saving. Even though they do not provide Type-C micro USB support along with fast charging option. The company called itself, it is a perfect shot and a perfect view mobile phone. As you can see here in the box, the perfect shot implement camera properties and the perfect view is for the portrait effects. In the back they provide a 16MP and a 5MP camera dual camera along with LED flash. 5MP camera is there. This is used for the depth effect. So depth effect includes portrait effect and blur and other options. About front camera, the camera is 24MP and you can see this is the camera options. I think the one of the best one in this mobile phone is the camera. They promise this 24MP camera. So moving on for the selfie. Now this is how I can take the selfies and uh, I can go for the selfies like this. So now let's take a selfie. So I'm clicking on here. You can see here. Another one property, it's called AR stickers. I'll show you this. I'll click on this AR. So you can see here. I'll click on this. And now you can see here. Once again, I'm really sorry. That's That doesn't look good, so good. So I'll take once again. And I hope this is good. Yeah, this is good enough. I'm smiling a little bit. This is the AR stickers and we have many emojis. You have to click here, you can see many emojis. So that's all about Vivo V9. But if you're thinking about the rate, the price is a little high, it comes from 22,000. So if, if you're going for the performance and uh, the price, I suggest you to go for Note 5 Pro. And if you're going for the complete performance, camera and such effects, I suggest if you're having a little plenty of money in your pocket, you can go for Vivo V9. Both are perfect and they have tremendous properties and I suggest you for that. The phone is available both in Flipkart and Amazon. You can purchase, I'll provide the link in the description. If I'm speaking about the designs, I, I give a rating around 4. If I'm about a camera, I give a rating around 4.2. About the battery, I suggest you I'll give a rating about 3.9. And because they don't have a fast charging option, it is lightweight and about other designs, not today, it's completely took from iPhone 10. The viewers, it's your turn to let me know what you feel about this phone, what things you have you want me to add in the next coming videos. You can comment on the comment section and that will give uh, a lot of confidence for us to go ahead. So thank you so much. You're not supposed to forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for the exciting videos.